Hey everybody, welcome to day seven of our blooming event. Um, here to unbox another uh, Bloom doll. Uh, these are due to be out in stores all over in um, July 1st. Um, I'm not sure the date of this video. Uh, it might actually be beyond that at this point, but um, we're um, muscling through, or uh, that's the, the wrong term I'm looking for. We are happily galloping through the flowers, <laughs> one by one. So I've been doing a video um, each and every day uh, for the uh, for 12 different bloom dolls that I got. I got a box, so um, I'm on to the second layer this time um, already. We've gotten one double. Uh, so that's not too bad, I guess. The odds are a little bit better than the, uh, some of the other series that I've been opening. Um, I don't like to feed into this blind doll thing, but the gimmick on these dolls are just so absolutely cute that I could not refuse myself. They're taking something, two things that I love. Growing things and collecting dolls and putting them in one. So how can I refuse? How could I even walk away from this, um, little marketing scam that they have going on here and they're the dolls are adorable um i will say that there is a little bit of quality control that needs to be tended to maybe for if they come up with an, a series two uh watching for smudged eyes uh watching for loose hair and loose stands so but i think that this company is a little bit of the under an underdog company um it is uh sky skyrocket so, um, but I think as they get bigger and as they grow, I, I, I always hope that companies do well, uh, that do well, put more money into their product. So, um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. As of now, they're $10 a piece, which honestly, you're getting a lot for your money. You're getting a good bang for your buck with these. Uh, I'm going to stop blabbling, 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 is that a word? And I'm going to take all this off off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, before I go any further, I have to take back what I've said in other videos. I thought that there was only blue, light green, and pink for the for the color scheme. Uh, right now, I have a purple. So, I don't know if that's going to make it a different doll, I hope. Because um, we did find out in our last video that um, the pot colors don't matter as to who's inside. Um, you can still find a double inside a new pot. Which is... Well, I mean, the luck of the draw anyway, because the outer layer is exactly the same on each one of them, so. But let me just get this top off. So, under that cover, we got our, we got our trusty little watering can, which are all the same for each one. Each, each one of Series 1. We have our checklist, which we might take a look at after, uh, to figure out which girl we have. And then we have this layer right here. We have this layer right here that um, comes off before we add water to bloom our girl. Just peels right off here. And then this layer has our stickers, which um, we have seen the sticker sheet before. So, so far it seems that when we get the same stickers, we get a new, we get a, a double. So I, I hope to be wrong. I hope that the stickers, there's just so many stickers and we just happen to get lucky and get all the stickers. Um, during our first set of set of videos um and this is a new girl because i really don't want two doubles in a row this is going to be terrible but these are so much fun i think both my nieces will would enjoy these okay we have somebody new somebody with yellow hair hmm I don't know who this is. Oh, it's one of the Pineapple Series ones. I hear it. It wants to pop up more. Here it comes. Alright. Let's pull it up all the way. I think so. So, let's pull her out and see who she is. Oh wow, she's so cool. 
Oh, look at her, guys. Look at this beautiful tropical pineapple-looking girl here. So I'm going to put her aside, and I'm going to see who she is in our checklist here. Where is our checklist? So this is Lola. She's from, like I said, she's from the Pineapple series. There are three different uh, series that um, exist. Uh, there are, not three. There are three different very color variations that exist within uh, the theme the theme here so she lola is our first rare so i'm pretty excited that we have a, a rare amongst our collection now um she is wearing a aqua bathing suit an aqua bikini and her hair is pink soft like a nerf ball and then it turns into a yellow on the top for the top part of the pineapple uh it's harder plastic um but still squishy Harder rubber, I guess, on the bottom of her hair to hold that on there. And yes, her hair does come off. Uh, let's see if I can get it off here. Her hair does come off here. And she has a pink molded on bun underneath. And the bun part the bun part actually acts as a little locking system and it locks right into the hair. You can interchange your hair with um, all your different girls. You can make different creations. Uh, what we need to do is pop out the um, flower pot here. Oh, there's a cone of shame. And it's a little bit hard to pop out sometimes. Sometimes it comes out pretty easy. Other times it doesn't. Uh, just a pre-warning, this part right here is what holds this kind of together. It's quite flimsy without it. So it basically, it's a cool playset, but it's not... Okay. So then you take the tape off right here. This opens up. You have your, um, you have your surprises inside. Your hamper, your armor, and then your tree stump that untapes there, and you get your stand and your purse. So let's see what we got for an outfit here, guys. Because you look at the checklist. The checklist is really cool, and it will tell you all the girls that you have. But they're always done in a cartoony form, so you never really know. Oh, ooh, okay. So to the oh, the rares are done up. I get it. Okay, guys. So since this is our first rare, we weren't able to actually discuss it or compare. But um, I've been I noticed now that the rare seems to come with maybe I could be wrong an extra accessory, and they're done up a little bit nice. Like you have like a transparent type gold shoe here, gold sandal, and we have matching um, eyeglasses. So we got sunglasses too. And our little pant outfit here has um paint detail on it so you can see all those little fern florons that we've, we've gotten this outfit before in a different color but not with paint detail so that's pretty cool so the paint detail is saved for our rares i wonder what the super rare ones have for paint detail and stuff and i wonder if the characters themselves have paint detail as well okay it looks like we might have a lime in there for our friend let's see so here is our lime mini friend. He's actually pretty cool. You can see the nice texture on him. And he's a lime green. He's got feet. And he's looks like he's giving himself a hug. And he's got black eyes. So um, put him aside here. And uh, let's see what we get for a purse. And our stand. Let's just pull that right off here. So there's our stand. And... Hmm. Did we not get anything? Hmm. Apparently, maybe the sunglasses acted as the accessory? It says they all come with handbags, so did mine fall somewhere and I missed it? Hold on, I'll be right back, guys. Yeah, so I don't know if she was supposed to come with a purse or not. It does say that there's ten surprises. So maybe the sunglasses acted like the purse in this series. I mean, in this certain doll. I don't know. We'll watch for that with other dolls. But uh, yeah, there, it was empty in the hollow. But I did. I do have the stand, which is a plus for me. I love when my dolls come with stands. So I don't have to go out hunting looking for a stand that's properly sized for them. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get her all together. I'm going to put her stickers in her little playset, And we'll show you guys um, the ending after that. Okay, so before I decided to put her completely together and put her sunglasses on, I wanted to show you guys how beautiful her bronze eyes are. She has bronze eyes with bronze eyeshadow, and then you can see the leaflets 
coming out of the uh, top there that are done in that are traced in black and then her outfit um her eyes match her shoes she's so so pretty guys like i said i don't know if she was supposed to have a purse or not but she i got ripped off of it somehow so here are her sunglasses on her without uh her wig uh they're kind of cute they don't fit that great but they stay on her head uh, pretty much so I'm gonna try and see if we can figure out how to put them on her when she's wearing her wig So here they are on her while she's wearing her wig. They're super mega stretched It seems like it's stressing the material so I don't really know if I want to keep them on her like this um, They I don't want them to break in the middle here because they are bending pretty bad um, But she looks good with them on um, They fit her they stay on I, I like I said it's a stressing the material a little bit so they were probably meant to go on her while she's not wearing her her wig um i don't think that there's going to be a way to put these underneath the wig while it goes on but that could be a thing as well um so i'm gonna go ahead and put her on her stand here and see if she's going to be one that fits on the stand proper okay there we go so here she is on her stand and here's her little lime friend Cute, cute. And here is her house set up. Uh, the stickers are quite similar, if not identical, to some of the stickers we've gotten from another um, girl uh, home decor before. We did decorate a little bit different. We got our cuckoo clock in there. We got our cactus and our snake plants and our little flower above the hamper. So, yeah. Uh, let me know in the comments below. If you've gotten this girl and if you've gotten a purse with her and let me know what the purse looks like because uh, if there is a purse that comes with her I didn't get mine so um, or is the glasses the replacement for the purse maybe um, if you like this video go ahead give it a thumbs up and subscribe and stay tuned for tomorrow uh, we will be doing um, opening numbers eight Wow. <laughs> Bye, guys.